Did you wonder how images and videos inserted into the web pages? In this video, I will try to demonstrate how to insert images and videos using HTML. To begin, let us use the previous example of HTML and CSS. And here is the file. If we open the index file, this is the output. What I'm trying to do is to have a picture appear in the home page in the video to the product page. Let us open the code, but first, I have here a folder for image and video file. If we open the image folder, we have a picture named house. Then if we go to the video folder, we have a video file named variable. Now let us go to the index file first. Right click, open with, and select the notepad. And here is the HTML code of index file. From the section tag, let us add a code to insert image using img tag. Then, from the source file, we are going to specify the path of the image file. Keep in mind that the image file is inside the image folder. So we are going to put the name of the folder, then get the name of the picture, including the extension name or the file type. So let us get this and paste it to the source. Now, this is a short and simple code to insert an image. So let us save the file and try to refresh the page. And here we go. We successfully inserted the image. Now, if you have noticed the image or picture is too large, display the actual size of the picture. So let us resize this into a bit smaller. And to do that, we go to CSS code to define the size. So let us open the CSS file. Then add a code here. To select the element that we want to change the property, just get the name of the tag, which is IMG, and use that as a selector. Then let us define the property which is the width to 400 px or pixel and then the height to 300 px or pixel then we don't for, uh, don't forget to uh, uh, put semicolon after the end of the line we have to save this refresh the page and that's it so we already done with the picture let us go to the video we want to insert a video into the product page so let us open the product page right click open with and select notepad but let us first change the level of our picture to this a dream house save the page uh, the, the, the code rather then refresh okay now we go to the product code at the section portion let us add this code we have video tag open and the closing tag inside of this video tag but first let us add an attribute to the video tag, the controls, so that when we display, when or when it display, 
we can manipulate the controls like the play, stop and so on. So let us add now another tag inside using the source src. Again, we have to define the path of the video file. It resides in the video folder with the name variable that in p4 copy this then paste it here then save the file if you look at the page the product page then we can play the video by clicking the play control but again if you have noticed the video is too large from the page we have to resize this in the css code so we go to the css code like the picture we should define the property of the video the width and the height let us define the size similar to the picture Okay. Save the file. Then let us see the difference. As you can see, the size displayed as we wanted. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching.